What is up, League of Legends Nation? It's Coach Jerezbro here back at you again with another Canadian VOD review, guys. You know, listen, man, people go pay for coaching. People offer me every week, hey, Rezzy, can I go coaching? I got $170. Hey, Rezzy, I got $200. Hey, Rezzy, I got $250. And guess what I say? I'll coach you for free, my boy. I don't need your money. You keep that shit. You know, you keep it. I'm good. It's fine. You know what I mean? Here's that free coaching, man. You don't need to go get scammed, man. You know, here's that real shit, guys. And I've made a couple adjustments to my play style, guys. And with these VOD reviews, you could really break down the sweet science. You know what I mean? That, you know what I mean? Resi box, Resi shadow box for us, Resi shadow box. You know, we're about to get into that here, guys. So, you know what I mean? If you like educational, someone told me you should do more educational content because that's what Expatatu, the Czechoslovakian, does. So, let's give it a try, guys, because I can't compete with these guys in the end of the day, guys. But listen, out of all the Shen mains, I put the Shen in the Shen. You know what I mean? I'm the only one to do that. You know, so it is what it is. Guys, check this out, guys. We're not playing with, you know, this ain't no, you know, your favorite caster, or your favorite analyst's elo. This is high LP, guys. 357, 324, 407, 245. I'm closing it on 200 LP. Something clicked, guys. I don't know where it clicked. It might be Jesus. You know what I mean? But something clicked and things are just going my way. I made some minor adjustments to the gameplay and I'm about to fucking skyrocket. You know what I mean? I'm about to fucking skyrocket. Um, 642 challenger top, you know, 400 LP. So guys, like this is the tippity toppity. You know, we're not playing like 10 years. We still got it. You know what I mean? It, we're, we're still putting in that work. You can see an 808, 288 and I'm about to head to 1K. So we're going to get into this replay, guys. And we've been killing the YouTube game these days, guys. So make sure... <laughs> You hit that, hit that comment, hit that like, hit that subscribe, guys, because you could just see the last few videos, man. Crazy views, crazy numbers. So I'm just ready to take this YouTube game by storm, and 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 take the take the I don't even call them plebs, you know, what I mean? and take the crew with me, you know what I mean? Because I'm here to teach you guys the game. Someone offered to pay me 170 dollars for coaching, 200 for coaching. I said, buddy, the coaching is free. Just watch the videos, you know what I mean? But they'd rather, you know, these guys, these guys would rather go pay money and get scammed. And just watch Jerezbo's channel and, and learn the ways, man. So we're going to get into it, guys. Check this out, man. Boom. Just hide it just like that. We're going to unpause. And you can see, right off the start, I'm already putting... <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Because that's how I feel. You got to walk on somebody's earth with confidence, guys. You know, League of Legends is just like a job interview. It's just like anything else. If you don't show up with confidence, you might as well go home now. You know, that's just how life is, guys. You know, that that's what it is. So right now, invading right off the bat. Listen, guys. I, oh, shit. Fuck. God damn it. Boom, we're back. So as you guys can see, just jumping back real quick. I wanted you guys to see what I was talking about. Right out of base, you can see that. That's important to keep in mind because that shows your team you're confident. That shows your team you're chilling. You're not really bothered, you know? And as I was saying, you know, as I was saying, I'm not going to edit that part out. I'm going to keep it in. It's like a job interview, man. You got to show up with confidence or stay home. Stay in the fountain. If you're not going to show up with confidence, stay in the fountain. So right off the bat, guys, we're looking for an invade. Now, it doesn't matter what LP you're in. Always look for that fucking invade. Always. Because here's the thing. Even if you don't get a kill, you're showing up with the crew. So the worst thing that's going to happen is you're going to get a ward in there. Even if they clear that ward, you have an idea where the JG is. You know what I'm saying? Harriet Tubman, you know, God bless her soul. She did a lot. But vision is what's important. I don't know. Was Harriet Tubman blind or was that someone else? They got fucked up this video. Was Harriet Tubman blind? Visually impaired? Yeah, I was right. Okay. Good, 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 good. Sometimes, guys, it's not just it's it's not just about impair. Let's keep it going, guys. Let's keep it going. Uh, I might as well pack it up at this point. You know what I'm saying? But fuck it. At this point, it is what it is. So we're already, you know, we're looking for that. Ari sees us. We see Ari. Again, it's fine. We didn't really get the ward, um, but we have a pretty good idea. <laughs> idea where Ch um lee sin is you know we we just we showed them that we're ready to play this so that's what matters we didn't get the ward out like i told you guys but it's fine it's totally fine and you could just see we're gonna keep cam on me this game you know the team played well i see ari so i'm chilling you know what i mean because for, for all i know they could be in our jungle so the question mark pings are coming out we don't know where people are so we're just easy easy i see ari i'm staying safe i'm staying safe you know what i mean that that's the theme of this gen support shit it's shoulder roll 
Floyd Mayweather, J Bro type shit. So I'm approaching slowly. You know what I mean? I don't know if they're stacked. I don't think they are because I seen RA mid. And now we're just walking a lane. You know, it's a it's a it's a good start. I figured out the runes. I made a small adjustment. Shout out to Ultra Blue Ahmed. He's a Tesla engineer and he's one of my analysts on my team. And he said, Redzi, I noticed you're not getting the shove early, and that's why. You know what I mean? He put the statistics together. So he said, I think if you take Q early and get the shove and use the shield, you know your LP will skyrocket. So we listened to the Tesla engineer and uh, things have been going well, man. So you can see here, I stopped taking taunt level one because sometimes there's not those openings that you're looking for, you know? So I'm taking Q, we're getting that early shove. The boys haven't shown up yet. We know Leeson's starting blue. So we're just chilling. And then all of a sudden you can see I'm posturing, posturing. I don't even have taunt. I took Q, but I didn't show him that I took Q yet. I didn't show him that I took Q yet. That's the Shen and the Shen type shit. You know what I mean? I make them think I have the taunt when I don't really have the taunt. And if I need the shield, I'll, I'll use it, you know what I mean? But we already have the shove. Now you can see I pull out the Q. I want to get these last hits in. I want to get these last hits in. We're getting the wave into the dirt. You need to shove your lane, man. Get level two. You could look to fight. They're petrified already. They're off the screen. And watch this move. Watch this move. I'm here. 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 It's at the turret. Kyrie Irving crossover. That's it. It starts here and it goes there. Starts here, guys. Goes there. Boom. I'm off to the races. You know what I mean? Because that's... A roam is kind of like, someone asked me last week, what, what does tempo mean? Tempo means, it's like, when's the baton getting passed to you? You know what I mean? You could be the anchor, the fourth runner, and you could be the fucking quickest. But, if that baton doesn't get to you, you fucking lost. So the number three and the number two, sometimes your number one is the fastest, because he's going to get that baton to the number two faster, who's going to get it tempo, you know what I'm saying, to number three, who's going to give for the tempo to get off to the races. So that's what tempo is. I'm ahead of you. So Zillion, he has to respond to me and look where I am. I'm already, you know what I'm saying? I did the race. How's it go? Da, 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 but I did the race, right? So I'm already here. Look where Zillion is. And the pings are coming out. So they know. They know. But this is North American solo queue, dude. You think they're going to fucking respect that shit? Fuck no. You could see someone's pinging. Someone's pinging. Um, Stickmaster Kai. Look, look, guys. Here. You know who. I don't know who. Uh, but he signals that uh, enemy team is missing, and so did Stickmaster Kai. But it wasn't enough because I'm already here. And the one thing I like about this Chow is he responded because a lot of times, guys, you're gonna be able to get this level two gank. You will be able to. But if the jungler is there, in this case, Lee Sin, it's China on China. You know what I'm saying? Lee Sin versus Chow. Um, if Lee's there, it's a risky sitch. But in this case, Chow sees the angle, we come up with the pincer, the sandwich, and it's easy money. You're going to see this. Look at this. Look at this. Patience, patience. I see Zhao. That's the goal call. Cat engages. Look at that flash. Beautiful. I don't even throw out the time. Why? Because I'm scared to miss. You know what I'm saying? I'm scared to miss. So I wait till I'm right on her doorstep. And then we just hit her with that short glide. And that's it. They knew, too. They knew. But it's too late, man. It's too late. Now, I was mid, Kyrie Irving back bot. You see, it's all about the crossover, guys. Boom, and then boom, back bot. You see that? Swinging between two lanes. They call this shit River Shen. I invented this in the end of the day. Shen has a 45% win rate support. I'm the only one in the world that plays him support at this level, man. For real. Like, these guys who play top, like, listen, man. It's like, it's like anybody can own a Camry. But this is the Lamborghini edition, you know what I'm saying? Like, anybody, like, Chen Top, that's Camry shit, you know what I mean? You don't really know macro, you just go build Titanic and you're like, oh, I'm so good at the game with Ignite. No, this is that real shit. This is that Lamborghini engine, you know what I'm saying? Boom, 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 you see that? Boom, 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 boom. And now, guys, we're back to chilling. There's nothing to do, so I'm just soaking the XP. Soaking, 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 soaking. Zillion is throwing bombs. If you play, I try not to judge people, but if you play Zillion, you're probably a fucking loser. Like, I hate to say it. I picked up Zillion for three weeks just because I thought he was so fucking broken. And then I looked at myself in the mirror and I said, who have you become? You know what I mean? How, how the mighty have fallen. And then I never decided to pick Zillion again. And now we're hard pushing. You know what I'm saying? We know that Stickmaster Kai and you know who are off the map. So we're just hitting the fuck out of this wave. You know what I mean? Hitting the fucking wave. And we want to get a reset in. We're already, again, tempo, right? We got this wave in. I'm gonna Zillion has tempo on me right now. He could go for a first roam. So I said it in the chat. I said Zillion has roam. I said it in caps just so it's fucking absolutely clear. We see him bought because Zillion's kind of bad. You know what I mean? And look, I, I grab it's been a dead man's plate. You know what I mean? That item is so fucking OP. That item's made the difference. You know, I'm closing on 200 LP because of the dead man's plate. But you could see the first buy is boots because I need to get on the map. Fuck a ruby crystal. I need to get on the map. So boom. You could already see it. The call. I'm already thinking ahead. The call is Kaisis chilling bot. The wave's gonna bounce. It's not frozen. And I said, we're gonna get. 
grubby so i'm already there you can see zillions am i now but i'm first i'm first because i'm a good player so here you know chow decides to gank top i didn't really like this because i thought we could start grubbies with no zillion on the map but he decides to gank volley and uh he should have at least waited for me but he didn't you know i didn't like that he went first i was telling him to wait but he decides to go you know you should know you should know that you need me for this you know um but volley played that pretty well pretty safe pretty safe and you can already see i'm object i'm obj focused i'm obj focused so i'm starting hitting grubs i'm fucking taunting them i don't see anyone that could threaten so i'm using my taunt i pink look at fucking Stickmaster kai look at this guy look at this guy he's still fucking confused he's like oh shit there's grubs on the map you know what i mean so boom we got two grubs we got a third one uh mids here which is good volley pops out of fucking nowhere this volley kind of surprised me because i thought we had a word here i don't know how the fucking volley snuck in there where the fuck did Volley sneak in? No, we didn't have a word there. We didn't. So we see Volley MIA. Um, but everything looks good so far. This is a pivotal moment in the game. A pivotal moment. I like these grubs and I don't like these grubs. I like these grubs because they make you fight early, which is cool. But I don't like these grubs because they're kind of new bait. You know, people know when to start dragging because it's been around for years. But people don't treat grubs like they're dragging because they're a little squishier. So it's like grubs are alive. We have to do them now. And sometimes you don't have to. Sometimes you could wait till I'm level five, level six. Like you don't have to take the objective right when it spawns. You take the objective when it's good. But because it's like these fancy things and it helps split pushers, everyone's like, oh my God, it's grubbies. We gotta go. So I like them and I don't like them. So anyways, guys, Volley sneaks up like around this corner. So we didn't have the ward. And then you could see they're engaging on me. But these guys are out of position. Zillion still hasn't shown up. So I'm like, boom, kill his volley. So I drop the Ignite instantly. Boom, boom, boom. I, I take the RE damage and we get the volley. Now, the problem with Shen support, guys, is these cooldowns, man. You can already see, like, a fucking 18 second cooldown. So I'm pretty much out of this fight. So this whole time, I'm pinging my cooldowns. I'm pinging my cooldowns. And right here, I start pinging them, like, back. Like, get the fuck out of here. And you can see, look, look, look at my pings. Look at my pings. Back, back, E5, E5. I was a little undecisive, you know, I should have probably just came out with, I should have saved my pings and then used the spam yellows. Here's another fucking horrible situation. I canceled an auto to give it to her and then you could see from a great situation to a terrible situation, you know what I mean? From a fucking great situation. All we had to do, kill that volley and get the fuck out of here. That's all we had to do. We were still good. We were still good. Like right here, we were still good. She hit... She had six, which made this fight really, really hard. The Ari that we fucking ganked, which I don't understand how XP happened. But right here, like, we could just run. Chow has an opening. I have an opening to get out. Cat has an opening. This is just a bad fight, man. Especially, I'm out. Look, my taunt's still a seven second cooldown. So we should just let Jax die and get out. Maybe my turnaround. Look at, look at Zin. Look at this. Look at this. This is fucking almost Challenger North America, guys. There's challengers in this game. You gotta let people die sometimes man you can't you can take a horse to water you can't make him fucking drunk you know what i mean sometimes it's better it's like a fucking investment Jax's life for the fucking grub zores one for one plus grubs worth but no man I, i'm even guilty of this you know the boys like shout out to the boys the boys want to fight and then look what happened we tried to save Jax, and look what happened boom one two and we get lead cat pings me here so i'm like oh boom we can burst this guy cat get some resets nope she flashes i'm fucking tilted you know and cat dies and now, you know, Chow, I mean, Lee Singa, he's uh, fucking huge now, you know? And she just got a shutdown. The Ari that was pretty much out of the game, you know, 0 and 2 is back in the fucking game. You know, up CS, we lost the wave mid. So I said GGFF sub gap. That's what I said at this point. But the one thing in League of Legends Season 14 is I don't know what they did to this game, guys. It's never over. I don't know if it's the fucking gold. I don't know if it's the amount of fighting that goes on it's never over so you can't really get tilted you really can't i did say ggff and then i decided to deafen and just focus so there's nothing for me to do at this point you know what i'm saying jungle's fucking huge you know three and oh i'm kind of tilted so i'm like i'm just gonna go soak some fucking exp stick master kai who hasn't done fuck has a full level on me i still don't understand how experience in this game works but i'm just chilling right now i need to get my xp i need to calm the fuck down i need to take a sip of the espresso you know what i'm saying i've been learning how to make uh been learning how to make um uh lattes you know what i'm saying i got that milk frother you know what i mean um i don't do like the fucking i used to work at a cafe i don't do the the butterflies and shit on top 
Um, and people used to say, like, dude, what the fuck? Like, you don't know latte art? Like, we're going to a competition for latte art. Like, fuck no, dude. Like, this is how I'm going to make it. If you want to drink it, drink it. If you don't want to drink it, fuck off. You know, I don't got patience for that stupid shit. You know what I mean? I just dump the milk. Like, who cares what your milk looks like, dude? That's so weird, man. But anyway, it is what it is, guys. Kaisa's on a reset. We're just chilling. Sweep the bushes. You don't want to get caught off guard. You know what I'm saying? Zill does a good move by bombing. Boom. Why did I do that? Why did I do that? I did that because, you know what I'm saying, uh, Zinni's on his way, you know what I mean? Zinni's still pretty strong too, he has a kill, a couple assists. And anytime, guys, you could go flash for flash, it's good, it's good because, you know what I mean, Shen's about pressure, he's about putting pressure on you. If you're playing him properly, it's about pressure, it's always about pressure, you know? So I don't give a fuck even if he flashes out, I don't care. I'd rather play against a Zillion with no flash, because a Zillion with no flash for five minutes, even if he gets ult, you know what I mean? He's gonna put himself in dangerous situation. So right here, I'm, I'm looking, I see Zin in the corner, I know Kaisa's six, right? So I'm like, bow, right? And you're gonna probably say, Rezzy, why not Aphelios? Well, you know, Aphelios with this new ADC shit, you can see he has fucking 1200 HP, Zill's 850, right? And he has Ghost Flash, so I'm like, fuck that, like, let's get this up, you know what I mean? Pull the Q, beautiful, look at that damage, look at that damage just from the Chen, bam. Kaisa plays this really well. This is the debut. Boom, boom. We're going to Phileas here. Return. Beautiful. We just got both sums. We got one kill. She dies. But honestly, it's worth, man. We got all their fucking sums. We got two kills. I'm picking this guy. I do not want to fight this shit. You know what I mean? But Cat's on the way, so we're looking, 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 looking. I still don't like it. We don't have the angle. You know what I mean? So people just got to learn how to call plays off, you know? Um, but Cat sees something because he mains Katarina or she. I don't know. You can't judge nowadays. You never really know. Like, just trust me, bro. Trust me, bro. I fucking deleted my Tinder because if you know, you know. Like, bro, like, this shit is crazy out here, man. Like, I don't care what gender you are. I don't care what religion you are. I respect all people. But, man, you don't even know, man. You, you don't even know. Like, with the filters and the surgeries, bro, anybody could fly to Columbia nowadays and they could take out your fucking Adam's apple. So, you really never know. Anyway. Back to the game. Cat sees something. You know what I mean? So I was like, oh, fuck. Because I didn't really see this. Because, like, yeah, my, in my opinion, like, the play is over here. Right? Like, we don't have the angle. Right? But we're kind of banking on them not having words. Does someone have sweeper? We clear this word. So I'm like, what the fuck? But I'm following these guys. Sometimes, you know, you got to give and take. You know what I mean? With this macro shit. Like, sometimes you're going to shot call and you want people to listen. And other times, you just got to follow the play. You know what I mean? Let me just make sure I'm recording, guys. Let me just make sure I'm recording. Because if I'm not recording, it's a fucking disaster. Okay, we are. We are. Um, so what I was saying is, like, sometimes you got to listen. Because these aren't bad players. Like, they know how to climb. So sometimes you listen if it looks right. So in this case, you can see me and Zen are, like, walking this way. And Kat's going that way. So we're like, what the fuck? So, like, let's go. Let's let's see what she's up to. You know what I mean? So we both... <laughs> You like, you like that little move? Look at that. Look at that in slow-mo, guys. One more time. One more time. One more time. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. So we clear this pink, and, and me and, me and, like, me and Chow are like, okay, Aphelios is going to be back on the map. Like, we don't know where they are. Like, we don't, like, are they on their other turret? We don't fucking know, right? So me and Chow, like, we're going to slow this down. Look at that. <laughs> slow it down. Look at this. Look at this. Oop. He turns around, and I'm like, whoop. <laughs> I like that. I like that. <laughs> Maybe we don't know what the fuck is going on. Cat slides in there, level 6, drops the ult, boom, that's one, that's two, that's a big fucking play, that's a big fucking, I, I, I come to her, I, if I was a little closer, I could have tanked the turret for her, you know what I mean, but that's the difference between junior and varsity, you know what I mean, what you just saw right there, like, like a junior Katarina doesn't see that, but he sees that, and that's why, you know what I mean, he's 400 LP carrying fucking games. Now, I had a play of my own here, you know what I mean? I know he's doing Gromp, but I'm like, hmm, where the fuck is Aphelios? Like, it's been a minute, right? Like, Zillion just died. Look at this fucking wave right here, man. Like, you gotta recognize these kind of plays. We just killed Lee. Why not just hang out in the bush, you know? He wants the Gromp. The ward comes out, so he, Aphelios' suspicion was activated, you know what I mean? Like, so, you know suspicion? That fucking, I'm, I might edit the clip in there. You know the guy who goes, hmm, suspicion has been activated. I like that guy. He's one of the funniest guys in League of Legends. That is suspicion. Suspicion has been activated. Anyways, guys, I know he doesn't have summoners because he just used them, so I'm, boom, I'm here. Fuck the Gromp. He's a greedy jungler, he gets a Gromp, but I get the full. He gets the six, so it ends up working out. Boom, boom. A big reason why I like Shen's support, guys. In this game, I don't even think I have AD runes, but with the four AD buff... If you could really put that posture on them and that pressure on them, dude, he does a lot of damage. You just got to hit the taunt. You know what I mean? So look, right here. Boom. 
Zin's not even here yet. Slow activated. Boom. 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 With the aftershock pop, that's a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage from your support, man. Um, Ari's here. We knew Ari was coming, but that play was worth the risk. You know what I mean? Because right, right here, mid MIA, cat just reset. We know Ari's coming. But at this point, I'm thinking, like, even if Ari's here, you know what I mean? Like, you look at these things. 747. I know Ari's alive. These are the quick decisions that you got to make. I know Ari's alive, but I'm like, I look, I pan here. I see this wave. And I'm like, what? Like, if he dies there, even if one of us dies to Ari, like, bro, this is so worth. Like, it's so fucking worth. Because that's, look at that. 20, 40, 60, 80. I know they're not all 20, but 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 40, 60, 80. We're going to count. We're going to count. So, boom. I'm like, let's go for it, bro. Fuck that Ari's here. You know, like, let's just go for it. Sometimes you got to be greedy in life, guys. Sometimes you got to. I'm not a greedy player. I play pretty smart, I think. But yeah, that's the play. That's the play. And Ari's here. Zillion's sh showing up. But Chow, like, what's why I like about these aggressive, like, if you if you're Asian and you play Zinzao on top of that, you know what I mean? Like these guys can be real aggressive, and I really like it. This guy's name is Boxes. He had a really really Chinese name. I was thinking of changing my name to something Chinese because, like, I think it could provide my team with a morale boost. Because when I see these guys. You know, because I'm playing an Asian ninja. So if I see, like, an Asian guy playing Zen Zhao or an Asian guy playing Lee, I'm like, oh, fuck, like, I gotta get on my shit, you know? Um, I'm pulling the wave because I want to make sure that the wave crashes. I don't want it to crash. We got some serious fucking damage. You know, she flashes. Like, they just... This is how you lose fucking solo to game. Now, even though they get to soak the wave, look how many creeps fucking Aphelios just lost of that wave. Boom, 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 boom. Ari gets it, but Aphelios is fucking out of it, you know? And right here, again... Lee Sin, guys, like, you got to remember, th this is their win con. Like, if they're going to win this game, like, it's off Lee Sin. And he already has a whatever you call this shit. Um, it does a lot of damage to tank his fuck. So I'm pinging back. Like, I, don't, I do not want to fight, man. I do not want to fight. Like, I don't want to fight. I dropped a W. I do not want to fight. Even though we could potentially maybe win this one, I don't want to fight, man. We just got to get off the map. We got to reset. You know what I mean? Mid gets to shove this wave, so Ari's in a bad spot. So this is just pure macro macaroni, you know what I mean? We're in a good spot. They can't really dive us, even with Zillion being six. So we're safe, but we're still chilling. Aphelios is mid. They don't got the juice. They don't got the juice right now. So again, we're, we're under the turret. We're just soaking the XP. Soaking, soaking, soaking. You see that? I'm trying to set up the minions for it, because in high elo, if you do not set up the minions, your eighth carry gets pissed. At this point, I don't think he really needs me to, but you want to set up your minions for sure, for sure. We see them on a ward, so we're chilling. We're going to shove one. One more and then we're gonna bounce you know what i mean i'm trying to get my six at this point i feel like i've made smart roams i feel like i've been in the right spot but roaming is really risky because i'm a full level down zillion six so you gotta get your xp man it's love it's 10 minutes and i'm still don't have my ulti um so i'm trying to get that asap asap i told you about these aggressive chows you know what i mean just some weird shit sometimes happens um you gotta watch out for these in chows um, we're obviously not in a position to fight, but he goes, fuck it, I gotta go. We knew, we knew Zillion was there, but he flips it, you know what I mean? And he has a bounty on his head. Um, it's a 600 gold bounty, so the outfit, just like that. That's why I remember when I said earlier in the video, guys, games are never really over, because of shit like that. Like, Chow, who we've been funneling fucking gold into, you know, um... He just shits his pants, you know what I mean? And the Aphelios that was legit out of the game. No sums, no farm, no EXP. They don't have an engager on their team, you know what I mean? He's back in the game just off that one play. 600 fucking gold, man. So he makes up for it. All that, all that fucking investment is just gone off of one stupid play. Um, so, you know, guys, I reset. I reset. I still don't have my six, man. This is fucked up. Like, this is fucked up, you know? Um, and he's pinging the zillion are like, bro, like, don't do that, like, don't do that, you know what I mean? We lose the dragon for it, and, uh, I'm like, what the fuck, like, we gotta go to these grubbies now, so I'm, like, taunting to the fucking grubs, you know? Shout out to Ghost Elaine, man, that guy did a lot for me, man. Um, maybe I should rename myself to Taunt to Grubs, maybe that's it, you know? That, uh, is a tribute to the fucking Ghost Elaine. Um, guys, make sure you go say what up to Ghost Elaine, I think he's back streaming, um, I like that guy, I like that guy, maybe we'll do content sometime. So, you know, I'm a little bit behind, they're looking for a play. Um, I'm, I don't have ult still. I'm fucking no. I can't. I can't believe this shit, guys. Like, I, I don't like. I don't know what they did to EXP. Like, top laners. I don't like top because you're stuck in a fucking lane. But like, bro, like I should not be level five, dude. Like, I don't know where I missed this XP. Anyways, just stupid plays. Like, just stupid plays. Like, it's like hero syndrome. Like, cat strong, Zin strong. 
and they're like, oh, fuck it, like, we have to fight. And it's like, no, bro, like, I've been involved in every fight. Look at my KP. Like, this is what I mean by, like, you got to play with your team. This is all about team play. There's a difference between solo queue style and team play. Like, there's two different games. And same with high elo and low elo. It's two different games. So it's like, you should just wait for my six. You know what I mean? Wait for me to be there and then play around me. You know? But instead, I, I drop my fucking ignite. Like, it's a bad fight, bro. Like, we didn't need to take that fight. But I don't know what the fuck they were thinking. Like, I'm off the map. You know what I mean? And they just decide to go. Oh, I, I guess I guess Lee Sin was pretty low. Let, let's, let's watch that back, fellas. Let's watch that back. So we see Lee Sin on the ward. We know he's on grubbies. I'm pinging that I'm coming. I'm pinging that I, I was taunting to grub, so my E's down. I guess it was close. I guess it's worth going for that. You know what, man? I gotta take it back. Sometimes I'm too hard on these guys. It's just close. It was so fucking close, you know? Disastrous, you know? Disastrous. Chow goes in there. It's just these risky plays sometimes, man. I don't have flash, so I ignite him, and he lives. He lives that shield, man. What the fuck? I finally get my six. You know what I mean? I'm telling Chow, like, yo, chill. We don't know where Zillion is. Grubbies are up. Let's play smart. You know what I mean? I'm just doing, like, a quick... I don't know what the fuck I'm doing here. Oh, I'm clearing a pink. Got it, got it, got it. You can see, so far, guys, I'm, this is a flawless performance. I have ult, so I, I know I can take this reset, because if anything goes down, I will ult. You know, so I'm looking top. Ballbeer's broken right now, guys. It's free, L it's free LP, uh, especially after that buff. He was the strongest fuck top laner right before the buff, but now he's that shit is broken. Shout out to Trick, man. Shout out to Trick. Hopefully Trick can, you know, I mean, Trick just had a second kid, guys. Um, if you're a Trick 2G fan, I love Trick. Make sure you send him a nice message, you know, DM, whatever. What up, Unk? You know what I mean? Love you, bro. You're a great guy. Shout out to Trook. Th Truk is trick 2G. I don't know if the baby would be 2G or like, you know what I mean? Like next generation. But anyway, I don't even know what I'm saying. Anyways, guys, I don't really like this fight. It's like killing Volibear doesn't really do anything for us. You know what I mean? Especially because Jax is in bad shape. This guy has this item already. You know what I mean? And it's just a bad fight. Like we should play OBJs. We should play around mid. We should play around bot. I really didn't like this play. But he said, fuck it. At this point, I'm like, dude, we're not going to be able to kill Volibear. Like, fuck it. Let's go for Zillion. So we one pop Zillion, which is great. It's the little things, guys. It's not the, it's not, it's not the big things. It's the little things. And then we have to deal with this guy. And you're about to see, you know what I mean? This guy with this item, man. His fucking raid boss status already in 10 minutes. Oh, look at top lane. Boom. Look at this guy. We have no way to kill this guy. You know what I mean? So I'm just trying to live, and I'm just trying to live. He dies. I'm like, oh man. So again, guys, like we didn't really need to take that fight, but it's just a small decision that we're bad. We're, we're bad. But I like when my team. I like when my team lets me shot call. You know what I mean? So you can see Volibear is having a great time. Jack just missed his big ass wave. He's feeling himself. We just lost Grubbies for that. So it's like this is not macro. I, again, I'm starting to get a little bit tilted here. You know. Um, picking up these last hits because why not you know zillion who hasn't done fuck right he has some kim some kp he's going over there and he, you know i'm starting to get annoyed here because if they just played around like my shot calls it would be different but you can see right here one of the things i like about shen is like he's still shen you know what i mean he still has that ninja capabilities so it's like if i was a nautilus like i wouldn't be able to really like do what i'm doing right here so I'm, i got that bait set up i'm putting that stance on him i'm starting to top him off break that bone plane pop 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 you know pop 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 how much damage do i do for i don't really want to calculate but you could see like i'm in there i'm doing work i do die but i pull out volibear enough you know and volibear has a 200 gold bounty so look at this guy look at this Look at this shit, guys. Look at this shit. This is crazy with this item. Holy fuck. He already heals like crazy. So anyway, it worked out. Not great, but it worked out. It's a pretty even game right now. 12 minutes in. Action packed. Ah, wow. 24 kills already. We picked up one grubby. We killed Lee. So it's not bad. You know, Ari somehow, like the Ari that I thought was out of the game, you know what I mean? It has a 300 gold bounty. So again, guys, we're resetting. I'm pinging my ult. And it's just, it's macro. It's macro. Nothing to do bot. So I'm looking mid. Somehow this guy gets soloed again. Again, I'm starting to get a little tilted. I'm like, holy shit, like the investments that I made for this Katarina. You know, I've been there for him, her, they, you know. And I'm like, man, like, at least play with my timers, you know what I mean? Like, you could just wait for me, bro. But instead, he goes, fuck it. He's feeling himself. He has four kills. He has Navori Blades or whatever the fuck that purple shit is. I don't really care. Um, 
And like when I'm pinging that bounty, guys, it's it's kind of like communication. You know what I mean? Like I'm saying like, guys, we need this. Like, watch out for Ari. She's fed, and we need this bounty. So when I can, whether it's me coming mid on a flash right now, or it's my ult, like let's chill. Like like wait for your sub. Like that's your sub's job. But instead, you know, you can see this boom. He slides in. He does a double flip. He wastes his flash. Congratulations, bro. You fucking played yourself. You know what I mean? Shout out to DJ Khaled. Um, Okay, yeah, it's a little thing. That's a terrible play because now he just missed two waves. It's a bad play, man. It's a bad play. So I'm like, Chow, can we look here? Like, I'm looking at Chow. I'm like, can we look here? I see Zillion at the corner of my eye. But, bah, right, 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 instantly. Pow. We get, we get Chow. And this is big, guys, because, like, Katarina might be an Asian guy, but we have another Asian guy on our team. And the more Asians that you've got on your team, the more chance you have of winning. So now I'm, like, already pivoting. I'm like, I don't know if Katarina is going to carry this game. You know what I mean? Earlier, I was like, yeah, it's Kat's going to carry this. But now I'm like, I don't know. So it's like, maybe we got to get Chow going. Maybe I got to focus on Chow. Because right now, when I'm looking at this game, I love this game for Shen. Because I was thinking of playing Nautilus. But I see Jax. I, I like that. Chow, I like that. Cat, I like that. Kaisa, I like that. You know? So right now, I'm like, you know what, man? Jax is fucking letting me down. You know what I mean? Cats inconsistent chow might be the one you know what i mean so we get that big fucking bounty you know what was that 450 g's you know what i mean chow's off to the races now man this is great this is great it's like the chinese economy like if you guys don't know like the chinese economy they're buying a lot of land in the in the states so it's kind of like what zinzao is doing right here you know what i mean he's on north american soil he's dominating the map it's really good it's really really good so you just got to recognize your win cons you know that's where i'm trying to get at um clearing this pink vision Vision is everything, man. If you know how to play the map, it's all through vision. You gotta buy pinks, man. You gotta understand vision. If you don't understand... I haven't been doing a great job this game of getting deep wards because it's just been permanent fighting. Like, you could see, there's just been so much fighting in 10 minutes of League of Legends, man, that, like, we haven't really been able to set up plays, you know what I mean? Because we've just been fighting, but vision is super, super important, man. You gotta get pinks. Pinks not only keep you safe, like, this is what you gotta understand about pinks. Like, they serve, like vision in general you always see me buy sweepers pinks some a lot of these games that start super because what they don't know can't hurt you does that make sense so like you're you don't even need a gank but if they if you have a pink they don't know if your zin is there unless they see them you get what i'm saying so it's almost like a bluff you know what i mean if you protect the pink they're just sitting there like damn is in there is he not there if you sweep a ward like damn like we don't know so it's not just offensive. It doesn't just allow Zin Chao to gank, right? A pink here, for example. I know we're out of lane phase. Well, not really, but this pink doesn't just allow Zin to gank, but it also keeps us safe. So it's like a two and one. For 75 gold, guys, it's it's game winning. It's game winning. You guys got to understand that. So right here, I'm like, okay, we have good leads. Still a close game. We have good leads. We need vision. So I'm getting in there. See Aphelios. No hesitation. No hesitation at all. No hesitation at all. Now, I don't know where Ari is. I don't I don't know where Ari is. I don't know where where um Zillion is. You know what I mean? I don't know. Um but I'm like, you know what, man? It's worth it. It's worth it. It's worth it. Boom. It's a flip, but it's worth it. You know what I mean? And we go for it. Kaisa's there, pulls the fucking trigger. Again, look at this shit. He's fucking pissed. You do these kind of smart plays, the smart windows, these guys are leaving the game. Zillion's here. We think about it for a second. We think about it. I'm like, uh, then I'm like, nah, because Lee Sin's gonna be here. Someone pinged it. Uh, Chow pinged it. So like, okay, fuck it. Let's just get this turret. You know what I mean? So it's a little thing, guys. It's a little thing. Sometimes you don't have to set up every play, but you just gotta take calculated risks. And in that scenario, I'm taking a little bit of a gamble, but I'm like, fuck it. Let's go. You know? Uh, we'll get the first turret really, really good. Kaisa's playing perfect right now. You know what I'm saying? You can see a CS. Boom. Yo now, this is that macro macaroni shit that I was talking about, guys. You know what I mean? I gotta drink water because I'm getting a little dizzy. But like you could see here. Look, 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 look. I'm here. I'm warden. Clearing that pink. I don't know where people are, but I feel safe. I feel safe. I feel safe. At this moment, I'm like, man, even if Zillion's here, we could still go for this play. You know what I mean? Even if Lee Sin's here, we, we, oh, well, we see Lee Sin mid. So I'm like, fuck it. We gotta go, right? We get this kill. I know I showed this already. We get this kill. I'm not gonna stop autoing. I don't care. And then I'm already looking mid. I'm already looking mid. I'm already looking mid. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. Fuck what happened, bot. You guys already seen that we took the turn. So I'm here, right? Pow. Look, keep your eye on it. The little things, guys. This is why Shen's one of the greatest supports, man. Trust me. Trust me. 
Because what can he do? He could do it top, like he could solo kill his lane and then ult for free. But it's the same thing. You're doing a bot. You're killing bot. You're getting your 80 carry fed, which is arguably in high yield, one of the most important players in the game. And you're also doing the same shit. You're playing them out. I'm watching, I'm watching, I'm watching, I'm watching, I'm watching, I'm watching. Pow. 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 I'm watching this whole fight. I'm watching the whole thing. This is an intense 1v1. This is like fucking anime. If you watch Baruto, Naruto, um, Jujutsu Kaisen, all those, this is like that level of shit. You know what I mean? This is crazy. Like, you can just see, man. This guy's name is Charmy, too, so he knows art. And I'm like, oh. you guys ever seen it? Chael Sonnen, I can't let you get close. I can't let you get close. You know what I mean? I like you, Ando. Don't do not like you. Ando, no. Well, no. Well, no. Please stop. I can't let you get close. Can you hear my Stop. Stop. And remember what we said in our old video, guys. Remember what we said in our old video. You know what I mean? It's like a two and one. Not only did I save my guy, but I just, you know, this Ari seems to have a good mental. I don't know if he named himself Charmy. You know, it's it's just like fluffy name. You know what I mean? Um, but these are the kind of plays that make people leave games or FF. Trust me. So trust me. Just trust me. Just trust me. Um, so you could already see enemies missing. Shenar. <laughs> like he's fucking mad, dude. He's fucking mad. And at this point in the game, guys, I'm 2-2-7. Two, two, and seven. I know Zillion looks like he has KP, but I tell my team, I'm like, guys, you guys have to perform. Like, I'm on my fucking game. Like, I'm everywhere at this point. Like, I'm fucking everywhere. Like, where could I have been that I wasn't? You know what I'm saying? Mid. I've been mid two, three times. Grubbies. I've been there for my JG. Bot. I've been there for my Kaisa. Like, I'm like, guys, you got to... Like, I don't know who I'm going to need to play off of, but one of you guys needs to wake up and carry this fucking game. Because I'm tired, man. I'm tired. I'm getting, starting to get tired, man. Carpal tunnel starts kicking in. You know what I'm saying? You start thinking about these casters and these analysts who could never, never break down the level of science like this. You start to think, oh, they're the ones with the jobs. You start to get a little annoyed. You know what I mean? The, the, I don't want to say the, the devil, but, you know, he starts whispering in your ear a little bit. You know what I mean? So you start to get annoyed, right? Like, damn, is Mark Merrill putting these motherfuckers on my team, right? You know what I'm saying? Who blocked me on Twitter, right? Still. Um... So I start telling these guys, like, guys, wake up. You know what I mean? Wake up. Like, I, I'm typing this. Like, I, I need you guys to lock in. Um, anyway. It's rinse and repeat, guys. Shout out to Dead Man's Plate. I think it's a better trailblazer. Even though it doesn't give the movement speed to your team, which is kind of overrated. A little bit more HP. And I like that damage that it gives you. I feel like in the mid game, that Dead Man's Plate damage is nice. It gets me around the map. It has good stats. It's a little pricey. Keep your eye out on Dead Man's Play because I think they got to change it a little bit because nobody's building this shit. Nobody. Uh, just me. Because everyone's just doing Trailblazers. It's so much cheaper, right? But I've been building Dead Man's every game. I grab my D-Man's Play. It doesn't have CDR, but it allows me to get on the map. You know what I mean? And again, I'm trying to be everywhere. I don't have ult, but I'm like, Jax, I'm going to hug you. You know what I mean? Like, I'm trying to be there for everyone, right? Because that's... Someone asked me last week what Pleb Life is about trying to be there for everyone, you know what I mean? Not just for myself, I'm not just playing for myself, I'm playing for the team. That's what Club Life's about. It's about playing for the fucking team, right? Like, it's easy to be like, oh, it's all about me, just give me the gold, you guys fucking stink. And I used to be like that. I used to be that kind of guy, IRL. But when, I shout out to League of Legends because League of Legends taught me how to play with a team. You know what I mean? And that's what Club Life is about, you know what I mean? You gotta, I might be low economy tank, one item, I'm gonna try to be there. Boom, 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 boom. Sacrifice for the for the squad. It's about the squad. It's not about you. It's about the squad. That's what it's about. It's right here, guys. I know where Lee Sin is. I'm pinging Lee Sin. I'm saying dragon, dragon, dragon. Let them have, oh, you know, dragon. whatever the fuck, Grubbies, Herald, let them have it. We can't we can't contest it. The reason we can't contest it is one, we have no top prior. You know what I'm saying? We don't know. We know Lee Sin's top. I'm not walking up. No, we're out of position. We're right on dragons. So it's like, fuck that. Let them have whatever they're going to have. Let's take this. It's going to be our first dragon, which is good. You know what I mean? In case it goes late, we just take a free dragon. Why not? Fire dragon is good. We get bot push. And right now, like, I see Katarina in the side, right? So I'm like, oh, fuck that. Like, I got to get her wards. You know what I mean? We know they're top side, right? We know they're top side. We know that there's no camps up. So I'm like, let's get, let's, let's get this vision. So I'm telling Chow, like, I swept this shit. Let's, let's look for something. We look bot for a quick second. 
nothing. You know what I mean? We needed to wait a little bit longer. We went a little too early. Um, but whenever we got our alt, which is really, really good. And uh, we're playing on our strong side, you know? We don't, like, we, we know that they're on Herald, cool, but we're gonna play on the side where we have numbers, you know what I mean? It's just fucking simple. It really is. It's really not that complicated, guys. You know, these League of Legends, these guys make it look like it's so complicated, but if you have, like, a little bit of a brain, it really is simple, guys. It really is simple. It's just about the control. You just gotta control yourself from doing dumb shit, you know what I mean? Because, like, you want, like, sometimes something looks good, but it's not. It's just not. It's just not. It's something you gotta identify, you know? The dumb shit would be to go fucking blind, running, you know what I mean? But we're just playing the map. We're playing the map right here. Everyone's listening. We get out that ward. I think I sweep here some more. Put the pink, and I'm like, man, maybe we could look. Maybe someone's going to face check. I don't know. We're looking on this Aphelios. Like, the eyes are open, guys. Like, remember the Shen in the Shen with the eyes? Like, the eyes are open. Like, we're looking for things. That's League of Legends. Like, setting up plays, looking for them. You could see, like, we're looking for stuff. We're trying to make shit happen. It's the mid game. We're fucking rolling. Zin's strong. Fucking everyone's strong. Like, this is the time we can break this game open. They're not weak either, but we can break this game open with this map control. You know what I mean? So we're setting traps. Someone pops a vision plant. Ah, we're spotted. Oh, man. <laughs> I remember saying that in game. Oh, man. Damn it. We've been spotted, you know? Um, Jax is like fuck top at this point. He's tilted. You know what I mean? He's been getting his ass beat by this volleyball. So he looks to roll mid. And, you know, it's too risky. It's too risky. Especially with a zillion. It's hard to dive. He's like, man, fuck that. Like, nobody knows what Jax is doing. He has to go top. I think I tell him, like, go cover top, bro. Like, don't do not do this. This is not good. This is not good at all. We don't want to give Volley any more, uh, any more, any more gold. You know what I mean? And we don't definitely want him to have that second turret. Um, and again, guys, I'm just telling them, my ult 17, chill, 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 chill. And at this point, guys, in the game, I start telling them, because I could see, like, like, right now, we don't have vision. And I could tell, like, this next five minutes is going to be real important. So I'm telling them, guys, like, we don't really want a team fight. Like, only if we really have to, like, for an objective, we'd rather split. We'd rather use my ult, play those side lanes, you know what I mean? Get the vision, let Chao do Chao things. We don't really, like, you don't want to risk a team fight with, you know, champs. Like, you know what I mean? This super fed volley bear in the mid game, Zillion, Aphelios. It's just, it's easier to play off skirmish you know what i mean so i think i was telling them like chill we don't really want to team play let cat do her thing um and we can play side moves. so again we're playing slow I, I don't really want to fight it looks like i'm caught but i'm like fuck that i'm out we're not fighting you know what i mean so we're playing slow but the volleyball's in there you can see shot caller shot caller they don't know what i want to do but i'm telling them nah guys nah 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 Ping back, ping back. Like, no, 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 no. We don't want this. We don't want this shit. Like, we don't want this shit. Especially because, one, they're grouped. Two, our Jax is kind of worthless. We have gold on Katarina. We have a big bounty on Chow's head. And it's just not the play. It's just not the play. It's just a random fight. And I'm like, no, 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 no. So, one thing I like about these high elo guys, if, if, if you're playing well, they will listen to you. That's why, I, you know, a lot of times I complain about my teammates who I think are bad. Um, because I want to play with good players. Because the good players, if you're doing well, they will listen. You know what I mean? They will. So we back off here. And you could see, you know, I'm pinging vision. Like, guys, look. Look. Off to the fucking races. You know what I mean? We have gold on Cat. She's pressuring the side lane. She showed that she knows what she's doing on Katarina. So I'm like, no need to do anything crazy. You know, I have R now. We're chilling. You know what I mean? So I really like that play. Because that's, again, remember, control. We're just controlling. We don't want to do dumb shit. They spawn Harold, so like, fuck, we might have to fight at this point. We got this shoved all the way in, you know? Yeah, Tur, it's whatever. It's whatever. Again, big shout out to Kaisa, because guys, like, this Kaisa doesn't look like she's doing anything special, but sometimes that's good. You don't want someone doing anything too crazy. You want someone just making sure they have gold, making sure they have items. When the time's right, we're gonna fight, you know? So now everyone's back on the map, guys. We wanna go back to doing what we were doing. Getting our wards set up. And then looking for a play. You know what I'm saying? Like, before, remember when we were in here, in here, looking for stuff, looking, 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 looking? We can't do that right now because we don't have wards. You know what I mean? So. One thing that I noticed about my gameplay is a lot of times I leave my AD carry when I want to go ward, and he dies. I've noticed that in a lot of replays. So I've been trying to do a better job of... When I want to go ward, I need my AD carry to back off. Like, I need him to be in a safe place, and I need to, like, escort him to that place, you know what I mean, before I go. Uh, and this is just one of those examples. Thank thankfully, he played it well, and he has sums. 
but you could see, like, just watch me here, watch me, I'm gonna hide the scoreboard, watch me. I'm like, there's nothing, I wanna go get deep vision, we have bot push, we know where Ari is, I wanna go ward, I'm sweeping, and then boom, Bulger comes out of nowhere. I shouldn't leave my AD carry like that. But thankfully, Bulger is low, Kaisa plays it super super well, we get a free zillion ult. Now this is a good fight. The fight before that was not good. We didn't have anything set up. Like, why force a fight? Let them make the mistake. This is North America solo queue. Even like the rank one players, they will fuck up. So right now, this is a perfect fight. It looks great. Zillion ult, Volibear's out of position. This is good. Cats here. We shove spot. Tempo, remember. Boom. Ow. Perfect. Look at that. Boom. Beautiful fun, beautiful fun. That's macro over my team. My team played it really, really well. You know what I mean? Volibear was already low. He tried to force a play. Now watch me though, because I know I see Lee Sin here. And I know he's looking for a fucking insect. I know. So I'm like, we just got... So in my head, I'm like, okay, we just got Zillion ult. We're all full HP. You know what I mean? Not really like a threat here. Ari's late, because Ari had responded here. Right, guys? So what I'm doing was, instead of my taunt's down for nine seconds, nine seconds it's down. But remember, it's that bluff effect. I can't do shit to this Lee Sin. He could probably fucking 1v1 me. He probably won't because my team is close. But I'm just tracking him. Remember? Rodman Rel. Remember? Tracking the Akali. Dennis Rodman. That's what I'm doing. This is just Dennis Rodman. I'm not really worth that much. Gold. I have one item. But I know the boys can handle this one. I know they can. It's a free one. So I'm like, you know what? Lee Sin is the problem. The Lee Sin with the fucking almost two items. Look at that. Look at that. I'm on him. Dennis Rodman type shit. Click and go back this way. Click here. Boom, boom, boom. Click and go back this way. Click here. And, and now I know he's out. So I ult. He's been zoned out. And it's over at this point. Lee Sin shows up. He does a kick. Whatever. Who cares? Who cares? He flashes. And then boom, 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 boom. That's macro. That's how you play a clean game. And now Ophelios is pissed. You know what I mean? Since I was pinging himself, he's feeling himself. You know what I mean? I let him have that moment. And I was going to tell him, like, bro, with, without me, you ain't shit. You know what I mean? But I let him have his moment. And that's the play. That's the play that opens her up. Up until that point, it was close. That's the play. Now it's just... What am I telling him? Uh, guys, it's over. Close it out. We're not hot, low elo. Let's put these deep wards. We're going to play off my R. It's easy money. You know what I mean? Now we're, now we're cruising. It was a little stressful there for a second. But now we're cruising, you know? I tell him, guys, keep playing the map. Only really group over OBJs. We're chilling. You know what I mean? And when you got them, guys, you just got to close it out, man. Because they're done. They're, they're about done. They're about to pack it up. You just can't give them hope. So that's the thing. Like, sometimes you got to control them. Like, now we're in a great spot. We don't need to fight. We can play for the next dragon. We can play for the next baron. We don't got to do nothing crazy, you know? And then they're going to start making the mistakes. So right here, you know, I don't got much to do. There's nothing really on the map. Kais is doing her thing. Everyone's on a reset. I want to go get bot side vision. We know where Lee Sin is. And I'm like, this volley bear is overextended. So we're going to look on him, you know? I popped the plant. Volley does not give a fuck. He's tilted at this point. Because volley bear has been playing pretty great. Like, you can't. I mean, the guy's been weak side a couple times, got ganked, um, and he's been a problem for our team, you know? But Kat's at the point where she just has too much damage, and uh, and she's been side laning, so I'm like, you know what? She has a lot of gold. I want to make sure she's side laning that she has this vision, you know what I'm saying? Um, boom, popping the plants. It's all about popping the plants. Um, I like plants. When I was younger, I didn't like plants. Um, I met this really pretty woman. She bought me a plant. I still haven't picked it up. Um, but it's a really, really nice plant. She showed it to me, so I do want to pick it up at some point. Anyway, um, I'm just popping the plants. We know where Lee Sin is. I just want Cat to be able to push these waves. And, uh, and uh, yeah, it's just, remember what we said, set up the vision and look for the plays. This is clean, guys. This is really good shit. This is League of Legends to me. This is League of Legends. There's a lot of fighting, but this is League of Legends. Yeah. Playing, like, picking the right fights at the right times, you know? Um... We're just waiting for that mistake, man. We're not doing too much, man. Baron's about to come up. We're chilling, man. We're chilling. We're chilling. We're not forcing anything. Um, I have Flash. Um, and I'm telling the Dragon. Dragon's a play. Dragon's 18 seconds. We have nothing else to fight for. Let's get this fucking play. Uh, maybe we're going to start speeding this up because we got to wrap this one up, guys. Um, getting the blue free. Again, popping plants. I'm taking that blue for sure. 
for sure. And I'm telling them, like, you could tell them, like, guys, like, there's nothing here. Like, there's nothing here. Like, don't even look at this art. Don't even look. We want the dragon, and then we want to play for Baron and close it up. You know what I mean? We have enough kills. At this point, this 5k gold lead, we could ride this shit. You know what I mean? To the fucking Nexus. So, um... We reset, we get pinks, and then we just close out, guys. It's really fucking simple. Really, really simple. Um, you can see that. 2, 2, 13, 15 out of 20 KP. What do I go buy? What do I go buy? I go buy a locket, because it's high elo, so, you know, I'm thinking... I'm thinking, like, I gotta get something for the boys. The boys are playing well. Um... Again, we don't want to do anything too crazy, but I have my ult. They feel desperate at this point. They're like, man, we're slowly losing this game. Let's just fight. Let's just fight something. You know what I mean? Chow's in there. Look at fucking Chow. He's fed. Um, Cat's fed. Jack's a little bit out of position. Volley says, fuck this shit, man. Like, I'm just going to go for something. And yeah, we fuck it. They're group, and they said, this is their Hail Mary. I early ult Chow because I'm like, fuck it. I don't know if this was a great ult. I probably could have been a little bit more patient with it, but I just wanted to be there for the boys. Um, and we're just playing front to back. We have enough damage, guys. We have enough damage. So I taunt the Volley Bear. Typically, like, you wouldn't want to invest that much into the Volley Bear. You'd want to save your shit for someone else, especially have a flash up. But at this point, it's like, let's just kill anybody, you know? Because we have a lot of damage. So if we could get this good kill, it's fine. Um, we're spacing it out, spacing it out, spacing it out. I dropped the lock. It's kind of late lock it. Uh, but we're just zoning, 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 zoning. Flash Tongue comes out. Ignite. It's over at this point, guys. It's over at this point. You know what I mean? Um, that was their Hail Mary, you know? Um, we're, again, we're not doing anything too crazy. We know Lee's up. We're not going to 50-50 Baron, right? Um, so we're, I like this team. They're not doing stupid shit. We just shove mid. I'm like, let me go get these wards in. And then uh, we probably need one more fight or before Baron. We see Lee. It's like, oh, shit. This is some Chinese on Chinese action. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, so, you know what I mean? Um, Chow has a couple levels on his brother. So he's able to take him out. Um, Flash is there. I was right there. We start Baron, guys. And then it's like quicksand, man. It's like quicksand. That macro is beautiful. Because, you know, once you get going, guys, it's... Um, I get the words out just to be safe, just to be safe. We want full vision. We don't want anybody stealing this shit. You know what I mean? We work too hard, man. We work too hard for this gold lead, man. So I'm there. I'm just scaring Zillion. Scaring, scaring, scaring. I don't like killing Zillion. I think I said that earlier. But we get this bear, guys. I saw she wrote. You know, it was a, it was a clean game. It was a clean performance. 17 out of 23 KP. It's high elo, guys. So, you know, in the end of the day, guys, I, I know I'm, you know, jerking myself off. But, you know, if you're trying to really learn the game, like, this is how you got to play. In my opinion, this is how you got to play. This is what League of Legends in North America is missing. Everybody just plays damage, selfish play style. People start playing this way. This is what's up. That's what's up. Um... That's this is the League of Legends I like, you know, on any champ that I play. I like this. And that's what I like about support, man. It's it's freedom. You could shot call. You set things up. It's nice. You're kind of like the quarterback in a way, you know? People think, like, support is bitch because you don't farm. But I think support is, like, the QB of the team, you know? You, you're you able to shot call because you're not stuck to a lane. You don't got to, like, constantly trade. I like this role. I like this role a lot. You know what I mean? Um, again, guys, nothing's different. We're looking bot. Ideally, I would not ult a fucking 0 and 4 Jax, but people are in position. So, in this in this scenario, he's almost like bait, guys. Like, I don't really want to ult him, and I'm hesitating here. I'm like, do I want to ult this guy? I mean, if he lives a little bit longer, it's just good bait. So, you know what I mean? It might be the play. So, at this point, I decide to ult him when it looks like they're committing. We have Cat on the way. We have Chow on the way. Get that taunt there. Good damage. Good fucking damage. Cat's here, and she's just going to mop him up, I think. I know she gets kicked. We just get the Ari, fuck it. Still, it's all good. We get the free turret. Tice is here. Look at this. Boom. Bow. Look at that shit. Wow, that's amazing. Avilius is still doing big fucking damage with two items. Um, but I really like this team, man. They, they're playing together. They're playing smart. Even with a huge lead, these games can still be thrown, guys. One bad fight. One bad fight, and you're fucked. Um, we see the TP coming out. We see the TP coming out. So I'm like, guys, chill, chill. Actually, I don't know if we saw that TP. We didn't. We didn't see that TP. We didn't. We see it in the replay, but we didn't. But uh, this is the higher level. I don't know where Volley Bear is. You know what I'm saying? He could be top. But I'm telling him, guys, what are we going to get out of hanging out here? A turret? Even if we get this turret, it's not worth it. We're going to try to kill Aphelios. It's not worth it. It's not worth it. We're not going to be able to end the game. Even getting this bot turret, it's not even worth it for us. So... 
you could see right now i'm telling him be cautious be cautious we don't see the tp but i'm pinging that volley bear is alive so we should not push anymore because volley bear is alive he could be right here but again this volley bear is a great player man he single-handedly like he was the only threat on the team you know really so i'm telling him to reset but she kind of greets for this wave and then volley bear was a good play flash the wall they get kaisa a big shutdown um and I like this child. She has a lot of control. You know what I mean? He's like, fuck that. I don't even want to kill Volibear. And I'm like, bro, like, enough people are dead that we can definitely kill this guy. So remember what I said. Sometimes it's give, sometimes it's take. Um, it's not even worth it to kill Volley, but he's just dead there. You know what I mean? I'm 100% sure he's dead there. And uh, Zillion's going to be too late to the plate. So whatever. It's not the end of the world, but it's almost, you know, they went for something. They went for something. And uh, they still haven't given up. So, you know, these are not low evil players, guys. These guys are playing these games out. So. This volley bear is 650 LP right now. So um if these guys are playing them out, you gotta play them out. Cause you, you definitely can win. I'm 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 down I'm down I'm always down to FF. I'm always down to FF because it's just too many years, too many miles. But like this is definitely the season where if you play to the end, you'll probably win you'll probably win some more games. I'm telling you. I'm telling you, trust me. In two months of League of Legends, I have never lost more free wins in years because of these fucking gold swings and the bounties and it's just crazy man it's crazy so katarina's just doing some shit here and we're like oh shit oh shit oh shit i remember saying that oh shit you know what i mean this is why you invest this is why you invest in these kind of guys you know what i mean triple kill really nice triple kill so given the vision you know what i mean um i don't know if i used my u you know what i mean for the fist bump but uh, he slides in there, he kills him too. So I was like, respect. And I think that's it, guys. I think they go ahead and FF after this. Um, I, but we're still playing smart, though. Just because it looks free, we're still playing smart. They drop the FF. You can see I'm pinging Dragon. I'm like, guys, you know, we can't end, right? And that's it. That's all she wrote, guys. So. A summoner has disconnected. Yep. A summoner Easy money. Um, guys. I know that uh, sometimes it's easier to watch um, some bangers, some close ones, really back and forth. But there's nothing better like a clean game, man. You feel good when you play a clean game. You feel good. You, you feel you feel successful. You know what I mean? You feel like, I know how to play this game. You know what I mean? I know what, what to do, you know? So sometimes I like showing you guys these games because they're clean. You're in and you're out. And... Um, I think it's easy to learn from a clean game because you get a lead, you keep that lead, you know, and um, or you're looking for the right place. So um, it's probably going to be a long one, guys, but I hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. Again, we're bringing some different shit to this YouTube game, man. You could just see it in the last three videos, man, we're killing it, putting up big, big numbers. Go check out the last few videos, guys, just different kind of content and, and the community is really... Um, I could really see the reception, you know what I mean? Like... It, <laughs> So, you know, guys, that's it for this one. If you like the video, as with the others, man, run it up. Let's go for 50,000 views. <laughs> Let's go for a thousand likes. You know what I mean? Let's give the league people what they need, man, because this is what they need to get better. I'm telling you, man. I'm telling you, it might not be the fanciest. It might, I might not have a Czechoslovakian accent. You know what I mean? But I put the Shen in the Shen. I really put the Shen in the Shen. So if you guys like the video, man, show some love. If you didn't like the video, dislike it. Leave a comment. Say you're a piece of shit and you're garbage at the game. I, some of these guys, some of these challenger guys say that shit to me, guys. You, I, I fucking hate playing with you. You suck. You miss too many taunts. I'm like, ah, it is what it is. It is what it is. Who, who you know? Who you know after 10 years still missing taunts? Still 200 LP. <laughs> That's macro over micro. Anyways, guys. See you guys on the next video. League of Legends Nation. <laughs> I'm out. <laughs>